Hi, my name is Pedro and I work at Oaxaca in Westfield. Hi, my name is Robin and I work at Oaxaca in Westfield as well. We were just here on uh, our wine training. We tasted a lot of wines and now we're uh, tasting the, the Mexican Estar Por Venir. And, uh, yeah. Yeah? It's, it's, yeah, it's really a great wine. Um, the smell, you can smell immediately that it's a very ripe wine. And um, when you taste it, it's like um, almost like mouth blowing. I mean, like mind blowing, like mouth blowing. And um, cool. it's really nice. It's ripe and I don't know. I like that we just tasted a lot of red wines, and this one is definitely my favorite. Um, it's sort of reminds me of, of Christmas. Like it's spicy and sweet, right? A little yeah. bit sweeter than the other reds we had. And, uh, and also, it's not as um, bitter, so I, it's the, 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 this one doesn't have as much tannin maybe. Yeah, so it's not going to go great. I, well, I think it will go great with anything like desserts and stuff. Yeah. Um, because it has that ripeness. Um, but it's also very uh, smooth, easy drinking, and um, it also has a light of softness. So, yeah, it's really mind-blowing. Great. <laughs> and which dishes on your menu would you recommend this wine to go with? I would recommend this with um, our steak dishes. I think it would go really well with steak and also with the, the feta. A lot of our, um, <laughs> our dishes have some cheese in it and I think this is the type of wine that goes really well with cheese. Yeah. What do you think? No, I think as well, um, even with our salad, I think it will, it will go great with, um, especially chicken sonora salad, I think it will go amazing with that one. Um, even the Jersey chocolate, I think, <laughs> because... Yeah. Yeah, be that's our dessert. Have, yeah. And our salads, even though they're salads, are, um, they have meat in them, so they're not really l that light. So, mm -hmm. so it is it is something. We have a steak salad. It would go really well with that, too, because yeah. it's it has the... And even our spicy food, because it doesn't have a lot of tannin, and it won't really give you that steamy taste. So I think yeah. with the pork bibel, perhaps, maybe... And the frijoles. the frijoles. I love that the, dish. I'm sorry. Yeah. Pork pibil. Like yeah, that. the pork pibil, and, 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 and that one also has some refried beans in it. And the refried beans have a very strong flavor, uh, but it's, it's not spicy, not so it goes really well with the red. Yeah. And guys, if you had to compare this wine to a movie star, who would it be, and why? Mm. I'll say Angelo, Angelina Jolie, because she's so adventurous, and this wine is adventurous. <laughs> Brilliant. That's, yeah, that's, that's a good one. Uh, do I have to pick a different one? Or no, no, not if you don't. Not, uh, not if no one's let, me see, let me see. Let me let me taste it. Okay. Mm, movie star. No, see, I think it's more of like an old Hollywood type wine. Actually, yeah. So I would say, like, um, maybe Catherine Hepburn. Peace. Because it's strong but sweet. Great. Thanks very much, guys. Yeah. It's been awesome. Thanks. And that is Esther Portnick.